My name is Katie Dam, and today I will be telling the story of Pandora. Now, the story of Pandora starts long before Pandora herself. There was a time when the Greeks believed there was no wrong in the world. There was a god to, that ruled over the sky and one to rule over the sea. The king of the gods, Zeus, had just won a war against the mighty Titans. He was very proud. But one of the Titans, Prometheus, sided with the gods, so Zeus let him live with them. Prometheus was humbled, but he didn't always agree with Zeus. Prometheus believed that humans had a great potential, but Zeus said they were puny little creatures. Prometheus decided to give fire to the humans, for he would, knew that they would prosper from this. But fire was a very sacred thing to the gods. It provided warmth, and it brought people together to, through the hearth. So he knew he would have to be very careful. He did eventually give fire to the humans, but when Zeus found out, he was enraged. So he chained Prometheus to a rock and had his liver pecked out by an eagle every day. Years after this, Zeus was still angry and wanted more revenge. Now Prometheus had a relative. His name was very long and complicated, so let's call it E. E wasn't the brightest, but he knew that Zeus was still angry and still wanted revenge. So, on occasion, Zeus would give him a gift. That seemed okay, but E knew it held terrible things, so he never accepted. But one day, Zeus found out that E wasn't taking them, and so he gathered the gods together and hatched a terrible plan. They were going to create a woman. Hephaestus molded her. Athena gave her wisdom and curiosity, and Aphrodite gave her beauty. Now, Zeus delivered her right to E's door, and they soon fell in love. But neither of them are aware of Zeus's awful plan. They had been living together for quite a while, when one day, a knock came at the door. It was from a visitor, an unknown visitor, and he held, he had a gift for them. It was a jar. At first, E was very skeptical and wouldn't take it. But then the stranger told him it was for his lovely wife, Pandora, so he accepted. But the stranger warned them to never open the jar, for terrible things would be unleashed. They kept the jar in their house and really paid no attention to it. Until one day, Pandora became curious. Now, she was a lovely maiden, but she was created by the gods, and the gods created her to be curious. And curiosity got the best of her. She crept into the room where the jar was held and opened it. Then the terrors were unleashed. Pain, sickness, suffering, and disease. And she wept as she knew those terrible things were traveling the earth. But little did Pandora know, one other thing escaped. Even in the darkest times, there is always hope. Thank you.